Well, we're here at Seattle's iconic Dick's Hamburgers, which uh, a lot of people would say is not only the best burger in Seattle, but the standard burger of Seattle. I got snacks in my bag. 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 I merely rocked in my bag. What's up? It's your boy Snack King calling. I am here. It's that time of year again. We got the RC Group collab going on. We're about to take over the internet today. Well, at least YouTube. This, this collab was brought to you by Curbside Pickup, and their thing is Rep Your State. So I'm in the great state of Washington, and what Washington is really known for is Dick's Burgers. This is where it all started in 1954 in the Wallingford neighborhood. Very little has changed since then. There are a few more dicks, but the food is the same, the prices are super low, and the service is fast. Dick Spady says those are his secrets of success. We stopped at Taco Bell for some Mexican eating, but Taco Bell was closed. The girls was on my tip. They said, go back the other way. We'll stop and eat a dick. In the sky, I shine. The city never looks so Thank you to Dix. Appreciate you. Classic Dix Deluxe beating any other cheeseburger hamburger Woo! in the world. People, somebody got a picture of you standing outside of Dix hamburgers waiting in line for a Dix burger. The one thing about Dix, I will say, the fries are pr pretty good. Uh, it's hard hard to beat the Dix fries. Sometimes there's a line at Dix, so. The, sometimes? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It, yeah, that's why you have to eat at a weird hour. Well, uh, <laughs> when you have to when you have to stand in line, you know that it's an important place, right? It's like absolutely. Bill's here. No, make him wait. <laughs> I got the kids with me. We gonna go out. We gonna do this vlog style. So let's go peep the scene. Sidebar: If you guys are ever in Washington and want to eat somewhere, man, them Stacks Burgers are where it's at. I had to stop and get the kids some McDonald's. Hey. Mm. It's hot. It's hot. We're out of here. So it's definitely raining outside. But we still gonna get this in. I don't know if I mentioned this, but this is a this is a diner stop. And and the governor just shut everything down again, so we can't go in anywhere. But we might just have to eat this in the car, man. <laughs> the original location is in Seattle. Um, I was gonna take the trip. I had the kids already packed up, snacks and everything. Man, it's raining pretty bad. And uh, it, it's raining even where we're going. So to have to sit outside, eat this stuff, I just don't know if that's a, that's, that's yeah. a good time. What does it cost? Tell me. Tell, hey, Any she dollars? said it. it Give this thing a big dollars? thumbs up. Many, you don't want to not do that. Subscribe to the channel. Many bodies gotta leave Sherry is very underrated. It does smell like mothballs in there. God's kings so that's what you are. Now we merely cogs in the machine that are routinely targeted tarnishing our dreams i'm harboring the faith that aligning is in the seam short right here is where our dunkin donuts used to be at it used to be a dunkin donuts man we ain't appreciate it all of our so people level. violence protesting they slaughter human beings a part of me truly sees dichotomy in between apologies and they grievance is swallowing are they reasonings fallacies are they feeding us wolves guiding the sheep tell me how much does it cost to be free? Tell me. How much does it cost to be free? I, I don't know what feels like. Yeah, can I get a uh, Dick's Deluxe? And then let me get some fries, please. Anything else? Yeah, and I'll take a uh, strawberry shake. That's it. Get everything. Bag secure. Time to eat. 
All right, man, we in the car. We back in this mug, man. We just got to eat. Hey, son, say what's up, man. Don't be weird. What's up? What's, just, what's, you know, what's up? Daughter's over here. She's driving. She's in the driver's seat because I had to switch to the passenger seat because I can't eat in the driver's seat. How do y'all eat in the driver's seat? As you see, we got the deluxe, which came with everything. We got some of the fries. Um, I've had Dick's before. I'm not the craziest fan of the fries. Like, I can actually go without. Uh, the burgers are cool. Uh, they're cheap, but everything's pretty much pre-made because you can't do no kind of custom orders at all. It all costs money. They say they do that because they want to avoid wasting. Um, they say a lot of their customers would get ketchup and not eat the ketchup, so it'd be a waste. I got a drawer for that, so I don't know. I also did get a strawberry shake uh, just to round it off. Probably end up giving the kids it. I don't know. I already see the fries. They got a nice crisp to them. They got a real nice crisp to them. Here you go, baby. Mm-hmm. Yeah. A little dot drive in right there. But they're nice and crispy. That real potato skin right there. I like those. I like those kind of chips. These are so good. Yeah, I, I'm I might have to take back what I just said. These are a nice crisp. Like the ones I'm used to having are super soggy and stuff. Like all flimsy, all wingling around like like a wet noodle. These, you hear that? Oh my god! You hear that? Look, <laughs> is it good? Yeah, I like it, son. You want some? Oh, uh, um, bro, yo, ooh, you you, am I tripping? <laughs> Okay. Hey, man, if you're going to go, I'm, I'm recommending this Dick's right here. And uh, where are we at? Federal what? No. Okay. We in camp. I, I recommend this one right here. Oh, my God. Okay. Sorry, this is not a mukbang. <laughs> I almost murdered those. Don't eat them all. That's a perfect opportunity to try out this nice little shake, though. All right, so I can tell you off the rip. I've been I've been on my strawberry kick a little bit. Strawberries pretty much slept on shake. Like when I only got them three options, that chocolate, vanilla, or strawberry, I tend to go for the strawberry. Uh, as far as the 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 consistency in here, is that the word I'm looking for? It's it's a nice thick, but not too thick. You know what I mean? I feel like Jack in the Box they got some really thick ones, the ones that like your whole neck muscle move up and stuff like that. Yeah, this ain't gonna do you like that, but it's still gonna make you. Get a little vessel right here in your forehead. But it's pretty good, man. It's nice and sweet. Let's get to this burger. Comes in these gold wrappers right here. These these are the deluxe ones. I feel like the other ones come in a different wrapper. So you always, you always know who got the deluxe and who got the, uh, the other one. Um... What happened? What happened? What happened to my burger? Why is it coming apart? It's running away from itself. I didn't grab no napkins either. But we always keep some in the car. We got kids. <laughs> but let's go ahead and take this off the wrapper. Try not to break this piece off. This, uh, this sucks. We was doing so well too, Dix. We was doing so well. I do not like the lettuce on here. It is, it is rather spongy. I don't even know if that's the word, but it's just, like, that looks like just dead lettuce right there. But the burger, I mean, like, as far as the cooking, as far as the cook on that mug, that thing looks pretty good. It's nice and juicy with a little sauce, a little special dick sauce. What the hell did you just say? Uh, Yeah. Yeah, it looks, it looks very good, actually. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to get this part right here before it falls all off. I'm a big fan of the chopped uh, pickles, which I think is just relish, sweet relish. The burgers are really good. It's two patties on here, actually. Which is crazy because at first it only looked like one, maybe because it was all broke. 
But it got two patties on that mug. But you see, as you see, man, big bite. You don't eat it in a couple bites, so that's why you end up getting at least more than one. But who knows, man? I've always kind of liked these burgers. It was the fries I was always a little hesitant of. Uh, but these fries right here are perfect. Like, I, I hope this is a new recipe and this is everywhere because I'm about to start eating over here. Because that's the only thing I don't like eating here for. Because I'll just get like six burgers. And then I'll just call it a night. I can't complain about this at all, though. Hey, man, Dick, Dick's Burgers, man, I'm definitely giving you guys a four and a half today. My burger was a little sloppy, and the lettuce looks a little run down, but, you know, besides that, the flavors are there. The taste is there. If you're ever in Washington, this is a must-grab. <laughs> so many jokes here. Definitely got to pull up to, to a Dick's Burger. They got they got them, um, they got about five locations here, I believe. It's, it's a must. Today's adventure was definitely a four and a half. It stopped raining. I'm going to get these kids to the house. We're going to chill out. But this is your boy, Snack King Cole, man. Make sure you go check out everybody else in the RC's and collab. And give a big thumbs up to everybody's video. I'll have all the links in the description box below. I Oh, make sure you connect with everybody in the in the review crew check just check out their page if you like it you like it you love it subscribe you know what i mean it's your boy snack king cole man peace out it's not there yet we're not there yet oh. <laughs> it's your boy snack king cole i'll try before you buy it i tried it when you bring your seattle you better go buy it Let's call it in the crossfire. Let's call it in the crossfire.